Hello everyone, welcome to my team building episode for my next Mass Effect playthrough where this time uh, this is inspired by Big Dan Gaming's worst playthrough event and his recent stream where the every member of the Normandy died in Mass Effect 2 but I think I'm going to do it also myself I'm intrigued on what would be my Mass Effect experience is if I kill people instead of saving them so this is going to be throughout Mass Effect 1 to Mass Effect 3 and the reason why I'm going to be doing this team building video is I can't simply kill up everyone in Mass Effect 2 because if I kill up most of my squads Shepard will die and if Shepard dies I could not import my save to Mass Effect 3 that's why I made this uh, complex uh, spreadsheet to know what their roles are and as you can see i'm also sharing a suicide mission survival car calculator which i downloaded in nexusmods.com to know who are going to be the squad mates and the desired outcome of the suicide mission so let's get the introductions uh my name is harriet i am doing uh movie reviews in this channel i also mainly play video games my main game is the Siege of Final Fantasy Opera Omnia, which is a gacha game, but sometimes I delve into Mass Effect and other games as well, such as TMNT. So if you're willing to uh, help me on this one, on team building, uh, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, it helps me grow. I want to reach 3,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Yeah, just give me that. Also, my birthday is on the 29th of July, but I'm not celebrating my birthday because I'm at work. Now, without further ado, let's get right into the yeah. Everyone, let's <laughs> everyone gets left behind. So my first playthrough, I was a male shepherd and vanguard. Uh, I think I think I was a colonist. Yeah, I was a colonist vanguard and a war hero. And now I I already created my character. It's an infiltrator. She looks like Yelena Belova from Black Widow. And she's ruthless and she's earthborn. And in my first playthrough, uh, the one that I killed up was Ashley Williams. So, sorry Kaden. Yeah, Kaden is gonna die on Virmar because of death. <laughs> Virmar. Yeah. Thing is, Kate, since I'm a fem chef in Mass Effect 1, Kaden is my romance and I'm gonna kill him up. So yeah, that's nice. Yeah. So this is going to be uh, Virmar uh, chosen, chose to die. Yeah. I don't know what he's going to be rolled, but he's gonna die. So this is not applicable. This is not applicable. Now, Ashley Williams. Uh, of course, Ashley is going to die in Mass Effect 3. Because she will die in the Citadel coup d'etat. Citadel. And she's gonna die by, by getting shot at. So I have to keep in mind that even though Ashley survives, she's my Vermar survivor in this playthrough, she's gonna die on Mass Effect 3 because of the Citadel coup d'etat. Word not Rex. I'm on a, de I'm on a debacle if I should. Uh, Kill Rex in Vermar or kill Rex at the Citadel around Mass Effect 3, but I think I can't do it on Rex, man. I can't do him dirty. I'll just <laughs> I'll just make it painless. Kill him on Vermar and shot. He's gonna be sh get shot by Ashley. So yeah, I already unlocked Vermar, so Rex's death is imminent. Garrus Bakaria. Now this is our first casual in uh, Mass Effect uh, 2 so from row 5 to row 17 I think row 5 to row 17 except Liara we're going to be uh, doing Mass let's you know what let's go with Liara and then arrange it as Garrus just so we can have all uh all Mass Effect 1 here. So, yeah. Liara can't die. She has the greatest plot armor. So, she's gonna die at the end of Mass Effect 3. 
by a Harbinger's laser. Uh, Earth, she has no role in the suicide mission, she has no hold the lines, go and the Harbinger laser. Yeah, she's gonna die through that. Okay, so Tally, okay, let's go with Tally first. Tally, this is where we get the uh, yeah, the suicide mission calculator up and running. Let's just enlarge that. I don't know if I sh if Tally should be loyal, but I guess I will make Tally loyal. Okay, uh, let's see. Tally is loyal. Yeah, okay. We're gonna make Tally loyal. And she's gonna die on Mass Effect 3. Just so her survival is uh, ensured in Mass Effect 2. And she will reach Mass Effect 3. So, she, yeah, I'm gonna make her loyal. She's gonna die on Rannoch by cliff diving. Now, the Hold the Line score is a special score system used to determine who are the best persons that are capable of holding the line. So, I, I'm, I googled the Hold the Line score. Let's see. See the hold the line score. The average group must the average points of the group must be two points. So Grant, Zaid, Gyrus are two points, each, three points each, if they are not loyal, and four points if loyal. Let's just get this out of the way. Yeah, and then Tain Legion, Samara, more one point each, two points if loyal. Jack. Tally, Morden, Kasumi, 0 points each, 1 point if loyal. So, since La Tally is loyal, we're gonna go back to the spreadsheet. Since Tally is loyal, her hold the line score will be 1. And I guess her role in the suicide mission is going to be the Oculus. Is it? It's going to be uh, Oculus. Yeah, this is the complicated part because we don't have to kill everyone yet. Okay. Garus Bakarian, I will not tag him as loyal because I want him to die on Mass Effect 2. So he's gonna die on Mass Effect 3. And he's gonna be disloyal. Yeah. So he's gonna die on uh, the collector base. And his role is uh, well, since he is not loyal, he's. I'm going to put him as the second fire team leader. And since Garrus is uh, not gonna hold the line, but I'm gonna put it three, and shot in the face. Shot. Okay. Miranda, even though she's not loyal, she can. Uh, you know what? First fire team leader. Then if Miranda is not loyal. No, wait. Uh, oh, fine. Let's put it second fire team leader. Okay. If Miranda is loyal. Then we're gonna kill her off in Mass Effect 3. But we need to break up with her. Or I'm not gonna read any emails. It's either I'm not gonna read any emails or I'm not gonna meet Miranda on the Citadel. So, no, do not meet Miranda on the Citadel, then she will die. So, if, she, if Miranda is loyal, her hold the line score is... Two. Okay. Her hold the line score is two.
And I think I'm gonna make her the first fire team leader. Or maybe oh wait, yeah I got it. Biotic. There. So she's that good she's gonna die on horizon. Jacob, uh, I'm not gonna make him loyal, so he's gonna be a disloyal squad mate, and he's gonna die in the collector base. He's gonna die in ME uh, two. He's gonna be our tech expert. He's hold the line score is the same as Miranda, right? Two. Okay. So his hold the line score is the same as Miranda. So he's gonna get shot. Grunt! I think I'll have him die in Mass Effect 3 instead, but he is not gonna be loyal. He's gonna die at the Atican Traverse. Uh, I don't know, eaten by spiders. <laughs> yeah. And it's all the line score since he is disloyal, is 3. And so Grunt will be regular squad mate. For Kasumi, I think I think I will have her not loyal. I want her to die in Mass Effect 2. Oh wait, am I going Oh wait, I'm gonna kill Zaid. So He's not technically gonna be loyal because he's gonna die at his loyalty mission. Uh, at loyalty mission, so this is NA. She's, so Zaid is going to die way before. Uh, shot, uh, burnt. Way before the loyalty mission, so. Yeah. Okay, Kasumi. For Kasumi, I, I, I'll have her die, so she's gonna die at the Normandy uh, explosion, because I'm not gonna upgrade my ship, and since she is not disloyal, she has a zero all the line score, but she's already dead, so yeah. Jack will also die before... So she's gonna die at the Normandy. Uh, she's gonna get uh, explosion. And I'll have her. And she, she is disloyal. She gets zero. Dane will also die at the loyalty mission. I mean at the Normandy. So that is the same. What is Dane's score if disloyal? Dane is one. Okay. Interesting. So these are my three casualties for the Normandy. Samara. I have her disloyal and I'll have her killed. And collector base. I'll have her killed at the hold the line. I hope she dies at the hold, hold the line score. If Samara is disloyal, her score is one. Okay, roll in suicide mission. Uh, squad. Squad me. Morden, I'll have him loyal. I want him to die on me three. Death by betrayal. So he's gonna die at the Chanka. So he's gonna be a squad mate. We're gonna calculate this before we proceed to ME uh, Mass Effect uh, 2. So Morden is one point if loyal. So I'll have him uh, betrayal, sabotage. And Legion, our final Mass Effect 2 squad mate. 
I guess I'll have him loyal. He's gonna die anyway at Mass Effect 3, so he's gonna die at Rannoch. Squad mate. So if Legion is loyal, his score is 2. And I think, uh, yeah, he's gonna die uh, by. Uh, I don't know how he dies. Uh, he. Uh, he faints. Uh, shut down. <laughs> I don't know. Shut down. Okay. Oh, you can see my cause of death now. Sorry. Yeah, here it is. Okay, so before anything else, we're gonna do our calculations. So I don't know how th would this work, by the way. So let's see. So Zaid will not be uh, active because I killed him. Uh, Legion is active. Zamara is active. Tal is active. Morden is active and loyal. Samara is disloyal, right? Yes, Samara is disloyal. Tali is loyal. Morden is loyal. Garrus is loyal. Grant is not loyal. Jacob is not loyal. Hain is not loyal. Jack is not loyal. Kasumi is not loyal. So, yeah. Then we're not gonna do any ship upgrades. Okay. The Oculus will be. I want Kasumi to die first. I mean, so I'm not gonna take Kasumi anytime soon. So this will be uh, Legion and uh, Tally. Tech specialist, it's gonna be Jacob. Fire team leader. <laughs> okay, we're not. I'm not sure on who's gonna be the fire team leader. Uh, let's give it. Let's give it to Tally. A long walk. Our biotic specialist Miranda. Fire team two leader is Fire Team Two Leader. Yeah, it's Garrus. Then escort I'm not gonna escort someone. Then our squad mate one is uh, we need Legion to survive. We need Tally to survive. We need Morden to survive. So it's either Samara and Grunt. Then for the final boss, I'll bring Morden and uh, Miranda. So, I put everything. Legion survived, Tali survived, Morden survived, Miranda survived, Grant survived. Okay. Uh, so you can see. Okay, see, uh, with the hold the line score, Legion is a... A loyal Legion, a loyal Tali, and a loyal Grant. Calculator Loyal Legion Loyal Legion is what two a loyal tally is one and a loyal grunt is Loyal Grunt is three four divided by two Yeah three point five it's over two so yeah everyone survived this are my survivors Did more than survive yeah, Morden survived, Tally survived, Legion survived. So basically, those who will die in Mass Effect 3 are gonna survive. So Legion... <laughs> so... 
So my so I have to pick Samara first before Grunt. Okay. Let's just uh said that. Then Garrus is gonna die because he is not loyal. And then Yeah. This is gonna be uh the setup moving forward. Okay. So that's uh good. We got everything set up. Now we're just gonna have to do Mass Effect 3. James cannot die. So he's gonna get lasered in Earth along with Liara. Javik can't die. So he's gonna die at the Normandy. Either by by depression or low war or Nor Normandy explosion. Edie will gonna die. She's gonna die. I assume Earth, and she's gonna die because destroy ending. Kelly Chambers and the uh, Normandy crew are gonna die because uh, they they will be uh... who's my first uh... Kelly Chambers, Collector Base, Steve, uh, they will die because no escort. So they will die by themselves. Steve will die at Earth due to getting shot down. Joker is gonna die last because destroy because uh wait oops Joker is gonna die at ME3 because because uh low war acid I think this is the team so the o only four loyalty missions I'm gonna do which is, which are Tali, uh, Miranda, Legion, and uh, Morden. Yeah, sounds fun. And this will be my uh, this will be the survival mission calculator. Let's see. Yeah, we need to kill Zaid, guys. <laughs> so, I'm gonna... Yeah. As long as Grunt is not loyal, he will die at an attic and traverse eaten by Wrath 9. So, yeah. This is all gonna go down to be my one of my greatest things ever created and yeah everyone gets left behind this is Mass Effect trilogy thank you thank you for watching bye bye